So some people say all good things must come to an end, and I'm here to tell you that the Neuron Writer Lifetime deal has not come to an end. Well, here we are at AppSumo, and if you have been watching any of my videos or you purchase software through AppSumo, you might remember that Neuron Writer was on AppSumo for about six months and left. Then it came back for about another nine months and just recently ended its stay on AppSumo. If you've gone to the AppSumo page for Neuron Writer, you're going to see this deal is unavailable. It's a bummer, we know. But don't be bummed out because Neuron Writer has your back and they've come up with a lifetime deal of their own. So here we are at the Neuron Writer page. Now, to get to this lifetime deal page, you're going to see in my description a link to Neuron Writer, and that will take you to their lifetime deal page. Now, that is an affiliate link. If you make a purchase through the link, I do get a small commission, so I just wanted to make sure you understood that. But they have this thing called lifetime promo, and so it does say promo. I don't know how long they're going to run this, but uh, I was contacted by Neuron Writer and reminded that if there are still people that missed out on that lifetime deal at AppSumo, they can come over to the Neuron Writer site and make their purchase there. When you get to the link here, just click on lifetime promo, and then you can look at this limited lifetime offer on the pricing, which is basically comparable to what was already on AppSumo. The bronze plan is $89. And the key thing to remember here is you get 25 content analysis queries per month. So every time you go to write a blog post and you need to optimize it, you need to do an analysis query. The silver plan is going to give you 50 content queries and the gold plan is going to give you 75 content queries. But there is something that I want to make sure and point out. If you buy in at a gold plan or higher, you're going to get the advanced AI templates and the advanced AI templates make it easier for you to SEO optimize your blog posts. So you're gonna get some access to features that the bronze plan and the silver plan don't have. The advanced AI templates, that's going to make it easier to further optimize something without doing it manually. It has some automatic functions that will optimize a post faster. So if you've already seen my Neuron Writer videos, I have quite a few of them here. You can go in and you can watch those as well and learn more about the tool. Obviously, if you're interested in the lifetime deal at Neuron Writer, you still don't have an SEO optimization tool. I strongly suggest considering one. It just makes your life a lot easier. And of course, gives you more of an opportunity to rank using NLP keywords and entities. If you already have a good background in Neuron Writer, I just want you to know the lifetime deal is here. If you don't, let's go ahead and take a quick peek at how you would use this tool. For example, a content query is how you start something out. I'm going to write an article about can I use a gravel bike as a road bike? So once I enter that here in the query section, I just click start. So when the query is complete, we just go ahead and click on this and then you're taken to the content editor section. But the first thing that you have to do is you have to look through and see which one of these articles that you want to rank against. There's a lot of user-generated content that gets surfaced when you're looking up keywords. And so typically things like Reddit and Quora and YouTube, I'll uncheck these. So I'd uncheck this Reddit one, I'll uncheck the YouTube one. There's a couple other YouTube here. There's another one here that I think is pretty good. We're writing about, can I use a gravel bike as a road bike? So you want to try to find articles that align with the search intent of your keyword. For example, can you use a gravel bike as a road bike? That would be one that you would want to rank against. And that's what you would do is go through and click everything that matches search intent. Trying to rank against user-generated content like Reddit and Quora and YouTube doesn't make sense. You really wanna rank against other websites and other blogs that are writing about this topic. So once we've done that, we click Next. Then we're in the area where you actually go in and you can start optimizing a blog post. There's a couple ways that you can do this. 
Now, obviously, Neuron Writer is called Neuron Writer. So you could write your article in Neuron Writer. I use Neuron Writer for SEO optimization. I really don't write full articles with the tool. I prefer a long form AI writer. I use SEO writing.ai. Maybe you're using Koala Writer. Maybe you're using Agility Writer. But I tend to use this specifically for SEO optimization only. I don't do a lot of writing with the tool except some of the advanced AI templates. To get advanced AI templates to further optimize an article, you need to be in at a plan that offers that. So just be aware of that. I'm not gonna show you those features today. I'm going to show you what my workflow is with my long form AI writing tool of choice, which is SEO writing. So when you're looking at this interface, the thing to be aware of is you want to be in this article tab and you can see all the basic terms that you'd like to have in your article and these extended NLP terms that you'd want to have in your article. And when you have these in your article, that's going to raise this score from a zero and get it closer to the 79. That's what we're shooting for is to optimize for that if we can. Now, again, you don't have to be exactly at 79. You, you're just shooting for a well-optimized article. So what you can do, because you have a long form AI writing tool that you're going to use, is you can just copy these terms. So I'm gonna copy the list of visible terms. These are all those terms, the basic and extended, that I wanna have in the body of this article somewhere. So I go over to Google Docs. Here are all the terms. Remember, I only want basic and extended. When you do a copy, you're gonna get the title terms, description terms, header terms. You wanna take those out. And we just wanna reduce it to the basic and extended terms we have here. Get rid of this. Now we have these NLP terms that we want to have in the article, so let's copy it. This list, I've copied that. So let's go ahead and go over to a long form AI writing tool. In this case, I'm using SEO writing.ai, and like I said, most good long form AI writing tools will allow you to take that list that I just copied and drop it in. So in this case, I'm going to drop it in the section for SEO, which is the keywords to include in the text. So I put those in, and then when SEO writing tries to write this article, it's gonna to try to naturally add these terms where it can. It may not add all of them, and it just depends on the AI writer you have uh, and how well it does that. But again, this is the way that I normally do a workflow with SEO writing is I'll write this article first. Now, the one thing that you wanna do is you wanna have a title so I go back over here, I click in the title bar, I ask it to generate a title for me. Using your gravel bike on the road, can you successfully convert it into a road bike? If you don't like a title, you can also just generate another one and see what it comes up with. I like this one better. Before I start writing, I have to generate my outline. So my outline is done. But the key thing is this, you're taking all these basic and extended terms from the Neuron Writer interface and remember, we copied them right here. This is where we got them from. You put them into your long form AI writing tool. If you're not using Neuron Writer to write your blog post, all right, here's the article that was written. Now, again, if you want to write an article completely within Neuron Writer and optimize it there as well, you can. I just feel that Neuron Writer is better at the SEO optimization side of things rather than the long form. AI blog post writing piece of things. So I prefer to use a dedicated long form writer. You do not have to do that, but most people have long form AI writers. And so that's why I wanted to show you how I use it within the workflow for optimizing an article and using Neuron Writer. So let's copy this. Let's bring this back over to Neuron Writer. Let's drop it in, see what kind of score we end up with. So we're at a 63 after having the article written. So we're shooting for a 79. Now, here's the thing. 79 is the highest of all competitors. The average for the top 10 for this Google search is a 48. So we're already at a 63. We're quite well optimized already. I wouldn't worry about trying to get to 79. You could certainly do that. 
you can see where some of the basic terms have not been used. If you go into your article and find places where you can use some of these unused basic terms, that's going to boost your score. In this little section, gravel bikes can handle tires from 38 to 50, so I'm going to do this. Instead of saying can handle tires, I'm going to say can handle gravel tires. Notice as soon as I used gravel tires, the score went from 63 to a 64. Another way that you can easily boost your score, you can look at your headings, you can look at your H2 and H3 terms. You could go through and look for places in the headings, for example, that would allow you to boost your score. Let's take a look at this conclusion. You could just say conclusion colon and write this is is a gravel bike an ideal road bike? That aligns with the topic, is it possible to use a gravel bike as a road bike? So notice that H2 term is now changed up here. We use that, so that turns green. And now our score went from a 64 to a 65. So that's how you would you know, go through and manually optimize this article and add these additional keywords where you can uh, to boost that score. So there's plenty of places that you can do that in this article. I'm sure that I could easily get this up into the 70s pretty quickly because essentially every basic term that you add is going to add a point to the score. If you could find five more of these ter basic terms here and add those and a few of these extended terms, you're going to easily boost that score up into the 70s. And again, the chances of getting up to a 79, you really don't need to do that. You just need to be as well optimized as you can without doing any kind of keyword stuffing. And that's the way Neuron Writer works. It's great for optimizing your blog posts. It's going to help you rank better in Google. I use Neuron Writer every time I write a blog post, I optimize it uh, using this tool and have been using it for well over 18 months now. So just quickly, again, if you missed out on the lifetime deal, this is your opportunity. Neuron Writer extended it themselves after it dropped off AppSumo. There's a link in the description. Use that link and then choose whatever plan you think is appropriate for the work that you're doing. So I hope you found this helpful. Until next time, take care.